everybody what's up it's kiki and i am coming at you guys today with a small haul um i was gonna wait until after the vib sale since i already got this stuff i just wanted to get it out the way so that that'll be a haul of its own so what i have is liquid lipsticks i purchased some liquid lipsticks from colourpop um kylie cosmetics nyx and I think that's it. So I want to just show you guys what I purchased. If you guys would like to see swatches of these, let me know and I'll come back and do swatches. I know I'm late to the party so you guys have seen these all over YouTube and Instagram and different social medias. But if you guys would still like for me to come back and show you guys swatches of these, just let me know. Right now I'm just going to do a haul. And I have a different background. I've had this background stuff going on for like over a year. Maybe longer than that. Longer than that. I've had this paper and I just never used it but I decided to you know switch it up a little bit from my normal background. I'm still going to use my normal background because I love it but I still just wanted to have a blank canvas you know just for when I'm showing stuff so that's what we got going on here. Let me know if you guys like it. But first I'll start with the Kylie Lip Kits. As you guys know they come packaged like this. This is actually the packaging it comes in through the mail and it has the mailing label up top. So if anybody was a thief and wanted to steal this, they don't know exactly what they was getting. This is the box that it comes in and it comes with a lip pencil and a liquid lipstick. And it just has the lips with the dripping paint on it and it says Kylie Matte Liquid Lipsticks and Lip Liner. On the back it has Kylie Signature. It comes with a little card with a personalized message on the back from Kylie. So I ordered two of the lip kits. I ordered Dolce K, Dolce, Dolce K? I think it's Dolce K because it's not Dulce. But yeah, I ordered this one and I also ordered True Brown and I really, really like the formula of it. I wanted to research and see what people thought about it and how they applied it. So what I saw most people said to do was apply it like while smiling and then it won't settle in your fine lines or whatever. It won't settle in the lines in your lips and that's what I did and I really like how it applied. It lasted all day and I didn't have an issue with True Brown. Right now I'm wearing... Kat Von D's Lolita and then in the center I have the Kylie Jenner Dolce K, Dolce K, yeah Dolce K, whatever it's called damn it. <laughs> but the only thing that I don't like is the liner because the liner is way too light for me I'm not going to use this so I'll probably give this to my cousin um but yeah other than that I like this and I like both of these like I use the liner their liners are so freaking smooth I love it they remind me of Colourpop they ship from the same city from Oxnard California so yeah they probably like sharing formulas or whatever but I really really like the lip pencil as well as the liquid lipstick so I want to order more but I don't want to order more because they're $29 I really don't need all those lip liners just sell me the liquid lipstick but I know it's a lip kit and they're selling it as a set so I really really like these I might order more, I might not. So I picked up two of the NYX lingerie liquid lipsticks just to give them a try. I found them at Ulta. I think at the time I got them they were buy one get one half off. So I just picked up two. I got one in Bedtime Flirt which is like this pinky nude color. And then I got one in, what is this, Beauty Mark. And it's like a brownie nude for my skin tone. And I really, really like the formula of these as well. They're like more creamy than liquidy. Yeah, I have no problem applying these. They dry really well. And I don't have any problem wearing them throughout the day. And I think these were like $5.99. I want to say $6.99, something like that. I can't remember. But. but I really like these and I'll probably pick up more of these as well. And as you will see, these are pretty much like the colors that I've been into lately. Like a brownie nude and a pinky nude and gray and yeah. So those... So that's all I got from NYX. Now on to ColourPop. I picked up two lippy sticks. You guys know I really, really love ColourPop lippy sticks. Everything I got from ColourPop, I've always purchased myself. I just am a fan of ColourPop lippy Like here are my other ColourPop lippy sticks. So I picked up two more. Um, I picked up one in Nevermind and one in Grunge. Now Nevermind, I got this because it reminded me of the leather lippy pencil. And I love the color of leather lippy pencil leather lippy stick is a lighter purple but never mind it's like the same color as the lippy stick leather lippy stick so i picked this up so that i don't have to you know dry my mouth out trying to apply the lippy pencil so as you can see uh never mind is deeper than leather and i also got grunge lippy stick but i meant to get the lippy pencil but i'm cool with the lippy stick it's like a warm brown color it almost reminds me of the Kylie Jenner brown? Nope, not at all. But 
I still like it. I swatched it. I can't wait to see how it looks on my lips. So uh, maybe I'll do a look with this and see if I like it. So I also picked up three lippy pencils. I got one in BFF3. I've always wanted this, just never picked it up. So I finally got this, which is like a soft brown color. Um, they have BFF1, BFF2, BFF3. And since this was the deepest shade, I got this and I've always wanted it. So I picked this one up. I also got one in two lips. And I picked up the satin matte lipstick in, or the ultra satin lipstick in tulips as well. So I really like the color of this. So pick this up in the lippy pencil form. And then I picked up Rooch from the K-pop collection. And it's just a muted burgundy color. So that's what BFF look like. And like I said, I really love ColourPop lippy pencils because they are really, really smooth. Trying to fill in your whole lips can get a little drying, but other than that, really, really like them for lip liners. And I have quite a bit of ColourPop lippy pencils as well. Now on to the liquid lipsticks. I got one from the Ultra Satin Lips, and I got one from the K-Pop, which was Rouge. And it's like a burgundy color, reddish, deep red. So I got this, I really, I was confused. I didn't want Chi because, let's face it, it's just too light. I would be mixed in. I have other liquid lipsticks that are light that I can mix. But I'm, I'm so undecisive on K. Like I see people wearing it. I'm like, oh, I got to get it. And then I see some people and I'm like, mm, I don't think it's going to look right on me. But let me know if you got K and if it's a must have. Because every time I see somebody, I'm like, oh, I should get it. But then I don't. So let me know what you guys think about K. Liquid lipstick as well as the lip liner because if I get one, I want both. I got Rooch and I also got the lip liner as well or lippy pencil. I got two lips from the Ultra Satin and I got the lip liner to this as well. Out of all of the colors that I saw when I watched swatch videos, this was the one that I fell in love with and I had to get. So yeah, I got this one just to see if I like the formula of an Ultra Satin because I'm not one who likes shiny lips or glossy lips, but I really like this so I might pick up some more of these let me know what's your favorite color of this I like the formula of this these are really really nice so yeah it lasts all day it's not it's not glossy or shiny or anything like that but it does have like a sheen and it doesn't dry all the way out so really like this formula and I love this color tulip I picked up Lumiere 2 um, I know this is Kathleen Light's co uh, collab with ColourPop and I hadn't picked up any of her other, you know, lipsticks or anything from her collab, eyeshadows or anything like that. But I definitely wanted to pick up something so I picked up the liquid lipstick and this is the color that I will wear and I actually like this. And I think this is being compared to Posey K which was actually one that I had in my cart but when I went to check out it was already gone. So yeah, Posey K by Kylie Cosmetics, this is a dupe for it, so I don't have to get Posey K. I got this one for six dollars and that one was 29. So it's my Ray Ray. I love it's my Ray Ray. She is so beautiful. I want her lips. Like seriously, I want her lips. But since I can't get her lips, I got her lip liquid lipstick, which in Stingray. I didn't get any of her other lipsticks either, but I definitely wanted to get the liquid lipstick because I love the color. And I definitely wanted to get something from It's My Ray Ray. Love her. And as you can see, these two colors are totally different so yeah okay and then next from the just regular ultra matte lipsticks i got beeper which is a light pinky nude color i got kapow which looks totally different in the tubing than it does you know actually on your lips this reminds me of colored rain soul so yeah it's like a dupe for each other so if you didn't want to spend the money for the colored rain one you can get kapow and the last one i got was lax I had already placed my order and then everybody was like, I hope you got LAX, LAX, LAX. So I had to get LAX. So, and as you can see, LAX and Rooch are not the same as well. Okay, and the ColourPop ones, these are more liquidy than actual cream or moussey feeling like the, the Kylie Lip Kits or the NYX ones. These are more of a liquid consistency. So they're a little bit drier and feel like wet paint when you're putting it on, to be honest. But they do last a long time. They don't you know peel off or transfer when you you know smack your lips together they don't transfer which was an issue that i had previously with the anastasia beverly hills one but their new formula doesn't do that so really loving their new formula as well but like i said with these they do have like a liquidy liquidy feel to them while they're going on but they dry they're a little bit drying but they don't 
peel and transfer. So at this point, my memory card was full and I got up to delete some stuff and make room and come back and finish my video. And guess what? I couldn't remember what the hell I was supposed to do. So I took a couple Snapchat selfies, posted a couple videos and yeah, forgot to close my video. So make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up. Let me know what are your favorite liquid lipsticks at the moment. And if you try any of these, what are your thoughts on them? And yeah, I love you guys and I'll talk to y'all later. Bye. Um, I'm actually...